friends, how are you doing today? Welcome back to Managing Mona's Mula, or welcome if you're new. I am Mona. Today I have a quick cash stuffing video to share with all of you today. I hope each one of you is having a very blessed day. I'd like to share a quick little sticker with you. See the little mermaid? Yesterday I went to get a massage and they shared this sticker with me. So I thought that was just super cute, right? It says relax and renew. So cute. So I have a quick step, cash stuffing video and I don't want to stay too long um, with this video. So I have $940. Let's start with the 50s. There's 50, 100, 150, 200, 250, 300, 350, 400, 450, and 500. My 20s, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 20, 40, 60, 80, 300. 20, 40, 60, 80, 400. My fives. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. These ones are going to be new and sticky. So one, two, three, four, and five. So that matches up with the denominations that I requested. So I had six dollars left over in my wallet. I have something I'm going to do with this six dollars. This is a recap of the nine hundred and forty dollars all of the items and categories that I'm going to pay and cash stuff today. And these are the denominations and it all totals $940. So I'm going to set this off to the side and I'm going to start with giving, which is getting $20. And I'm going to save this money um, and donate it probably at uh, either Thanksgiving or Christmas time. So I'm going to add $20. So there's 20, 5, 30, 5, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50 in my giving envelope. My utilities, the only utility bill I have to pay this time is my internet, and that is getting 150. The internet bill is due on the 21st, so I'm going to add this. And I don't really count this one because it's I'm always taking money out for those bills and putting money back. So it's just like a revolving cash fund. My spending is getting 150. So that is 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. and 50 and I have nothing left in this envelope next is my food and I have a little bit of money in here so I have $20 I'm going to go ahead and leave that in there because I always need extra money for groceries so I'm going to add 150 this time that's 50 100 and 150 plus the 20. So that is 150, 5, 65, 170 for groceries. The whole idea behind this cash stuffing is so that I can avoid using my credit card. If I have the cash, it's easier to just 
use the cash. So my fur kids are getting 75, so there's 50, 70, 5. And I like to establish a little bit of a fund in here in case I need to take them over to the vet or get my older cat groomed. So there's 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 5, 10, 15. So 215. Car juice is getting 50, so that's 20, 40, 45, and 50. I'm going to have to start reporting to the office one day a week, and it's not too far, but I will be using the car juice a little bit more, so I have to be prepared for that. So car juice now has 20, 45, 55, 61. Next is my miscellaneous, which is getting $20. And that is 5, 10, 15, and 5 ones. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Plus the tenant that I have in there, that makes 30. So I have a nice little sum in case I need to run to the store for something. Cough medicine, I've been coughing a lot, so I apologize if you could hear that in my voice. I'm battling a cold, so I'm hoping it's going away now. So I apologize if I sound off today. So my beauty envelope, health and beauty. Is getting 200 today, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. And this is to contribute to the gym membership. I have some doctor co pays and some medicine I need to pick up. Um, so that's and I have a, a hair appointment that's coming up. Sometimes I like to get my nails done. Most of the time I just do them here at my house, but in case I wanted to get a manicure or a pedicure, we still have money in the health and beauty envelope for that. So now I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 220, 240, 250, 300, 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65. All right, 365. So now I get to pay my doctor bill and my co pays and my medicine. Next, I have birthdays and gifts, which is getting 25. So there's five and 20. Let's see what I have in gifts. It'd be nice to use some of this money for Christmas gifts. I don't anticipate any other birthdays the end, from now until the end of the calendar year, so I can probably use some of this for uh, Christmas gifts. So that's gonna be nice. Okay, so I have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 10, 25, and 30, $130. So the first savings challenge that I have here is my Let It Bloom. And my Let It Bloom is getting $100 today. So there's 50 and 100. So now let's see what I have in my Let It Bloom. There's 50, 100. 150, 170, 190, 200, 10, 20, 30, 
to 80. Let me count this again. Sometimes I mess up and I <laughs> I mess up and I miscount. So there's 50, 100, 150, 200, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Yes, 280 in cash. The rest is in the bank. I am going to end up using this to go to a concert next year. So I hope to have some fun at that concert. All right. So then my next savings challenge is my jar of hearts. And that is also getting $100. So there's 50 and 100. Okay, there's 50, 100, 150, 200, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so I have 380 in cash, the rest is in the bank. So that's a nice little addition to my two savings challenges. That's all the cash stuffing I have today. I have decided to begin my 100 envelope challenge. And whenever I have leftover money in my wallet, where the six dollars came from i do not know um i'm going to just stuff this in my little box so let's start out with one dollar in my aren't these little envelopes so pretty they're from dark lovely budgets over on etsy so i'm going to start my 100 envelope challenge today so there's one and my five dollar envelope this is going to take me forever to to complete right <laughs> i can only imagine how long it's going to take me to complete this okay so at least i started it um i'm excited I love this little challenge. I've seen others complete it here on YouTube, and I'm like, wow, that really takes a lot. So I have started, I've officially started my 100 envelope challenge. Yay. So I'm excited about that. Only thing I have left to do is to color in my little savings challenge book. So I have $100 here. Let's see what color. I always have a tough time picking the color here. Let's pick um, this pink. How are you doing with your challenges? Some of you are rocking and rolling with those challenges. It just amazes me how much money we can save with these challenges isn't it incredible it might not seem like we're making any progress but after a while it, it you look up and it's you've made a lot of progress so you all give me such inspiration to continue it's so easy to just give up you know and use the money somewhere else but I'm going to continue until I finish this challenge. And my next one is my Let It Bloom. And I also have $100 to color in here. So let's see. Let's see. Um, 
there's a 60 over here. Sita, I hope your daughter, your family members are feeling much better. I said a prayer for you and I hope your, your beloved family members are feeling better. So there's 60 and I need 40. So here's a 40 over here. Okay, this concludes my savings challenges for the week and my cash stuffing for the next while. Wish me luck. I do not want to use my credit card. So this is why I'm using the cash. But I'm gradually making progress on the savings challenges, right? Anyway, well, thank you for spending time with me today. I really appreciate it. And I hope each of you is doing well today. Stay blessed. It's a season of fun and trick-or-treating and fall weather. I'm thankful. I'm grateful and blessed. My God has blessed me and I'm very grateful and thankful. And I wish each of you a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves and be kind. I'll see you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.